When you've got good friends there. Uh, hello, uh, 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 welcome back to the Jeff Show. Uh, if you don't know what this is, it's a product review show, and we do it every uh, single day of the year, and we make sure to only do it on Mondays. Uh, today is Monday, November 18th, and I am here again, as always, uh, back from the dead with uh, my good friend and co-host uh, 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 Pete. And I am so glad to see you again, Pete, because the last couple of weeks have been very difficult. There's been a lot of people on the show that I haven't really liked at all, and it's been so tough not having you around. And I have to say, having you back just makes me, and I wouldn't do this, and of course I don't really want to do this, but it makes me want to French kiss you and ride you and do all sorts of fun things that would be sexual in nature. But of course, those aren't things... Those aren't things that I'm actually going to do. We have had a crazy couple of weeks, and if you've been enjoying the show, please go ahead and smash that subscribe button and those like buttons because that's the only way that we can survive. Uh, but we, we, we've had some problems on The Jeff Show, and Pete pointed these out to me when we rekindled um, uh, our, uh, rekindled together. Uh, and one of the things he said to me was that ratings have been down and people are not viewing the show anymore. And I kept asking Pete, why is this happening? Why are people not um, enjoying the show and viewing the show? And Pete said to me, uh, let's go on a little retreat. And we went on a retreat together and it was really just my bedroom. And we sat around and talked and cuddled and really just... and. And really just uh, talked out all of the different things that could have been going on. And when Pete was playing with my hair, I remember this specifically, when Pete was playing with my hair, he said to me, I think it's because we haven't had any uh, women on the show. And of course, we had had a, a woman on the show, uh, but the uh, woman was his wife. And we all, um, ugh. <laughs> um, we don't like her very much. Uh, she's not a very nice person, and um, many people have described her as the beast. And certainly, um, the uh, other co-hosts we've had have done nothing for us. Um, people hated Candy Expert. Um, many people commented saying how much they didn't like him and, um, and how they wished Pete was back. And so after a lot of debate, Pete said, let's get another woman to come hang out on the show with us. And I said, I'm not a huge fan of the idea, but I will consider it. And then he said, I'm going to take it a step further. Let's bring in a model. Um and I thought I was not a huge fan of this idea because I uh, model already and I feel like this show has only room uh, for one model. And uh, But uh, nobody is watching the show and I felt like if that's what brings people back to the show, then we will go ahead and uh, try out this model uh, uh, experience. And so uh, Pete met her um, at a at a 7-Eleven. They were both getting um, some sort of um, coffee from that fun machine that also puts a little bit of chocolate and a little bit of chai in there. And uh, they met and he asked her to come down onto the Jeff show. And she actually said that she was a huge fan of the show, which was surprising to me as it was to him. Uh, and so uh, uh, here she is, and I I'm going to go ahead and introduce her now. Uh, and, and your name is um, uh, 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 um, uh, Anna. 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 Or is it Anna? Uh, both ways. It's a both ways situation, I see. <laughs> you can say any. You can say Anna or Anna. Now, Anna, you're a model, is that correct? Yes. Okay, well, that's not a big deal, as you know, because I uh, model too, and I know that uh, it's certainly not the biggest deal in the world. Just thought you should know that. <laughs> um, Anna, sometimes I want to know where a model's from. Can you tell me a little bit about where you? I imagine that you're you're from a big, uh, you're bi a big nation where there's lots of people that hang out, and you're at, you're at the you're the life of the party. Where where exactly are you from? Oh uh, well, I'm from Ukraine, mm -hmm. and like tiny little city in Ukraine. It's like a little, little. I grew up in the countryside. 
Mm -hmm. Okay, so that uh, so uh, so a tiny a tiny place in a place I've never heard of. Thank you for uh, for oh. And ukulele. Mm-hmm. And a ukulele, yeah. And uh, Anna, when I think of models, and I think of model, and because I often model myself, so I know a little bit about this community, but I think about uh, models who, and how they exist from day to day. And I always imagine that models live in a model house, like a, it's like a dollhouse, except there's lots of models, and there's models in this room, and there's models in this room, and they do all sorts of fun things. What kind of house do you live in? I actually currently am in the model house. And I'm glad to hear that, Anna. Oh, okay. Uh, now, Anna, I just want to ask you one more question before we get to the super cool product review, because we, we've only had a few other models on the show, and you're, you're probably the, the only other one um, besides me that people have taken an interest in. And I just want to ask you, what was your toughest modeling job? What was the hardest thing you ever had to do as a model? I, I, the, I don't think there are <laughs> hard things to do in the modeling. I, I, oh, you don't think it's very hard? No. That's no, interesting. No. Uh, well, let me tell you a little bit about what it's like for me to model. One time I was hired to go to Iceland and I was hired oh. to go onto a tundra there and I was uh, asked to wear uh, the trap. And the trap is essentially just a, it's a G-string with just uh, my um, pockets uh, being covered. And um, I was asked to work in the super cold and I wasn't ver wearing very much and and the uh, one and one of the PAs there kept saying, you are so beautiful. You are so good looking. And the difficulty for me, and I know that you had said you didn't have many difficulties in the modeling industry, and I'm just telling you that I have. Um, the difficulty for me was that I kept saying, please stop distracting me with compliments because I can't get anything done. I can't model properly if you're constantly complimenting me. And it sounds like you haven't had an issue with that. No, not at all. Mm -hmm. well, you know. That's how it goes. Well, Anna, thank you. Honest, Anna, thank you so much for being on the show. And we're really excited to review this product with you. And I know it'll be great fun, especially with um, with the whole gang back on the couch. Uh, Anna, so this is a super cool product. And I don't know if you've heard of this. I was somebody that heard of it pre-sale because I'm a model. And of course, people send things to me when um, they want me to review it because they want to know, they want to have a beautiful person like me review it. And, and uh, you might not have as much experience with that, but if you hand me that, um, Pete, this is what I'm talking about. Just hand it to me. The, uh, the, uh, this is called um, a, f a fetish. <laughs> what a fun name because it almost sounds like fetish. And fetish is something that I have about a lot of things. Feet and Pete and denim and um, and and Peter and just things that make me feel good on the inside and the outside. Sometimes latex, fittish. What a fun name! And this is a tone down C uh, C uh, B D, and we all love C B D. Um, it's essentially just like marijuana, except it doesn't have the marijuana. I don't know if you know that, uh, Anna. And it is a cooling, hydrating, and energizing. So it does lots of different things. Not only does it cool you down. It energizes you, and that's almost like an anti, um, uh, an oxy moron, and I think that's super cool. So what I thought would be fun is I have a feeling this is really going to cool us down in a fun way, and in a fun way when you have too many models in a room, that kind of fun way where you don't know what's going to happen because we're all models and <laughs> what might happen today. Well, you're not, Pete. Okay, so Pete, go ahead, and you're going to take a spray of this on your face and see what it feels like. Oh, and it's got a nice spray and a nice sound. Can I hear the sound as you're doing it? Yeah. One more time. Okay, that's enough. That's great, Peter. And it and it smells nice, and it's got it. And I'm gonna try it here um, uh, on my face. <coughs> and it's got a very. It's almost got a little bit in my mouth, and it has a green tea sensation, which is something I particularly love because green tea is both good for you and caffeinated, and that often does. This is really making my face. Um, feel a little loose. <laughs> um, now, I'm going to let you give it a whirl, Anna, because you said you're a model and and, and maybe you can... Uh, and 
Okay. Yeah, and just a couple of... Okay. Okay. Thank you, Anna. And I guess um, that's what they do in uh, the small village of Yukonistan. Okay. Uh, this has been a great show, don't you think? It's been a fairly interesting show. Uh, Anna, you were one of the most um, interesting guests that we've had on the show, and we're super excited to have had you. Um, and... Uh, we're probably going to go ahead and take the rest of the week off. I know this has been a particularly difficult week, and I deserve to take the rest of the week off. Uh, if you like the show today, please go ahead and smash that su subscribe button. If you liked Anna as a model, uh, go ahead and and, um, and we'll link the uh, her Instagram account below, and and you can check it out um, sometime. And and um, okay, it's very comfortable. And, um, and, 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 you know, comment below about how you feel about her behavior. And if you want to see a product reviewed by me or uh, Anna, um, uh, go ahead and put that in the, in the comments. Uh, and, and we'll go ahead and see you next Monday. Got to be with your friends for life.